Hello and welcome. Silray is here. As you can see, I'm in the flight mode, but this is not about flying. This is about keybinds. So if you are not into watching uh, keybinds and whatnot, then just don't watch this video, all right? Just letting you know that. So a while back, um, many of these keys, well, a handful of them anyway, um, reset back to their default values after you, even after you had changed them. I actually haven't kept track if they have fixed that, so I'm going to test this out the hard way, I suppose. Going to try this stuff out and um, see what happens. Also, I'm going to change the keys. So there is that. Let's get cracking then. Um, firstly, movement, because I know what I want to do with movement. Um, uh, I can I can get rid of uh, some of these things. Firstly, uh, roll goes uh, roll left goes here. Oh, this is new. That is nice. All right. That is nice to know. These things can uh, that that can I can leave here. Double tap for throttle zero goes here. And throttle max goes to T. Uh, throttle up. Come on, T kicking. Thank you. And G. Right. Space break. I'm going to do away from there. Match target velocity. Decoupled mode goes in here. That way I have nice easy access to decoupled mode. Um, strafe up and strafe down. This is the uh, big question thing. Uh, because I could do strafe up and down in... Um, Easily in, in, um, what's its face? In mouse keys. It's like, that That would be very nice and easy for me to deal with. But I have a feeling that I want to do something else with the mouse keys. Like, put all the weapon group on mouse keys and just call it a day, alright? So, a uh, strafe up goes here. And strafe down. No, wait, that's up. Yeah. Uh, strafe down goes here. Strafe left. And... Strafe right. Alright, all movement keys are set. Um, strafe forward, these can do the same way. Left, alt, and... Come on, left, alt, T. Thank you. And... Left, alt, and... G. Cycle safeties. Um, I'm going to leave that. I mean, of course, I could uh, use these things. I'm going to uh, unbind this stuff here. Uh, and, and then do all the same stuff on the decoupled. So the I have exit same movement keys for decoupled as well as I do for, you know... um. For the actual, actual, actual uh, keys. So that makes life much easier. Strafe forward and strafe back. Because there is obviously no throttle when you're doing the decoupled. Um, roll. And roll. And actually, space break is going to become space bar since I rebound space bar. Uh, boost key is C. That I know for by heart. It's one of those things I always use. Um, yeah, I realize that if you are a WASD user, this kind of keybinds are going to look really odd to you. It's something you get used to um, after a while. I used to play a lot, and I mean a lot, of MMORPGs over the years. And uh, a lot of them, I'll leave these unbound for the moment until I find much better keys for them. And a lot of MMORPGs uh, require a lot of keys. Like, play old school World of Warcraft, where certain classes uh, needed how many effing keys to do their stuff. 
It was beyond ridiculous. Actually, yeah, this can this can stay as it is. Uh, I need to figure what I'm going to do with fire weapon group four, though. All right. Um, but uh, where is missiles? Fire launch missile goes on button four, and I have targeting somewhere for those missiles. Acquire missile lock. All right, nice. So as I was mentioning, uh, you needed like 20 plus hotkeys just for all your spells, like easily 20 to 40 somewhere between those. And so I moved the movement keys away from WSD to middle of the keyboard, TFGH. And I have been doing that since like 2005, 2006, something like that. So, I've been doing it for about a decade or over. That means I am so used to it that I, um, I just use it for all games I play. Uh, but also there is a physical reason. That's the fact that I have uh, broken certain fingers a uh, couple times already. And which makes, uh, makes using like WSD uh, painful because I can't use control and shift keys. Uh, too well when I'm using WSD, so I need all of them. Um, need need the uh, um, rather need the, the other keys. Oh. All right, let's unbind all of this. Unbind all of that. All right, now let's uh, let's talk about uh, targeting. All right, so. If I do hostile targets and friendly targets, do I need um, uh, all targets still? I guess I do. Um, nearest hostile, nearest hostile is going to be where? Um, one could argue that nearest hostile key w would be awesome if it was here. Like right here, so I can really, really easily uh, reach it. Right? Nearest hostile. Um, then cycle hostile targets would be Alt J. So I can cycle them. And cycle them backwards would be Right Alt J. So I can cycle them both directions. Right? Very, very easy. And. Um, Friendly targets would be here, like above it, and cycle friendly targets backwards. Actually, I will do Alt U for cycling all targets, and cycle friendly targets backwards is going to be right Alt U. I don't think I need cycle all targets backwards. I don't believe so. Because if, if I have friendly and hostile, that basically is like most of the targeting I will ever need. So, um, yeah. Uh, also, uh, pin focus target and cycle pin targets will be nice. Target focus, alright. Yeah, 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 the whole focus, focus thing. Uh, pin focus target and target focus. Um, which way, which order do I want to do those in? I'll think about that for a moment. Critical mode toggle and then I would need the gimbal lock and mo cycle mouse aim mode as well. And critical focus. Alright, but targeting is there for the most part. Alright, um... Fire weapon group 4. Where do I do you? Number pad 7, or number 7. Fire weapon group, alright. Uh, did I have anything? Okay, I'm going to uh, unbind these things. Like from here. Did I have anything in uh, 
in in the numpad by default. Is there anything in the numpad by default? There has to be shields in the numpad. Oh yeah. Launch countermeasures needs to go and cycle countermeasure ammo needs to go from there. Um Also, a uh, launch countermeasure goes here. And cycle the ammo goes here. So they are like so nicely side by side, easily reachable by me. That's countermeasures, right? Countermeasures with a K. Okay, uh, anything else in the... Um, those two need to change badly. Um, these are F keys, right? Yes, these are F keys. Alright. So I don't have anything else in... Um, in in the 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 but the, the these eight two four six nine seven five all right so essentially uh, I have zero and comma and have the whole entire upper row there completely for use fantastic that means this stuff goes over there right this stuff just goes over there um. Self-destruct. Oh, I have a light toggle. Oh, nice. I can toggle lights. Fantastic. I want to be able to toggle my lights. Um, exit seat goes here. This is nice and easy to reach. Um, so uh, it goes there. Oh, actually, speaking of which first... Um, is there anything here I would like to rather move over that way instead of using F keys? Or I could use, um, I could definitely use just number keys for all of this and skip them out of the F keys entirely and then use F keys for the, for that stuff. Oh heck yes, much better idea, right? HUD overview. Weapons grouping, power management, shield, yes. All of this stuff needs to go elsewhere. All right, um, mobby glass. That's the main one, and it's gonna be here. Cause that is, uh, um, actually, I am going to put it here. It's even easier to reach. So there we go. Um. Uh, there we go. Now, uh, was there a reason none of this is actually bound to number keys for flying? Uh, I am fairly sure there is, uh, on foot there is some number key binds. Yep, for selecting weapons. That's fine, I can do those on foot somewhere completely else, but, um... I mean, come on, is there nothing in the, uh, like, am I missing out on something? Oh, right, right, right. Power presets are here. Those are really easy for me to put elsewhere and still have easy access to. So that's, it's not an issue. Right. Mobile glass, uh, that's the main thing to have over here. Um, then I'll do the this stuff in the other direction and do uh, be able to still do the power distribution in the other direction. And suddenly I have the F keys entirely free for myself. Overview, weapons grouping, hello. Weapons grouping, power management, and uh, shield management. There we go. Um, scoreboard. Who the hell cares? Scoreboard goes somewhere like here. I don't honestly care about... I honestly don't. HUD interact mode toggle. Alright. Um, HUD interact mode toggle needs to be... Fi find its place somewhere... Um, somewhere nice and nifty. Okay, so where was those power and how many keys did I need for those? Um, power distribution key, increase power, decrease power. All right, all right, all right. Um, all right. Actually, speaking of uh, of these things, uh, 
Do I want a couple of them in the uh, in the F keys? Because I could. I mean, this is stuff I can definitely put uh, somewhere very far. So I'll, I'll definitely do these things on the um. Like re rethinking it a little bit. So uh, if I do exit seat right here and uh, I do eject and uh, self destruct elsewhere um yeah 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 this does not need to be double tap i'll do exit uh, eject there and i will do self destruct right here and i will put light toggle somewhere as well where would i wanna put my light toggle hey right, it's going to stay unbound yeah still for a bad all right so that means I can still uh, move these things over to the F keys and just leave them there, right? Um, show overview, weapons grouping, power management, shield management. Moby glass. Moby glass is going to stay here, right? And uh, then I can do the uh, whole... Whole, 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 um, uh, where was it? Power management. I can do the power management entirely, uh, yeah, I can do the power management entirely on, no on number case, still. Oh, heck yes. Oh, heck yes. Oh, you know what? What I just thought, because this is easy for me to uh, do with the uh, with the right hand thumb. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, remove that. Uh, exit seat. Eject is going to be here. Uh, exit seat is going to be here. Then I'm going to use a uh, uh, alt key here. Um, left alt and that is going to be eject. And left alt and that is going to be self destruct. Alright, cool. Now those things don't come in my way. Um, and what I can do is I can put this stuff in the numpad plus and minus because those are really, really quick to do. Um, Double tapping uh, where it should work there as well. Let's actually double check that the do double tapping works. System overheating. All right, all right then. Awesome stuff. And back to keybinds, advanced controls. All right. Oh, okay, so it uh, it did the whole, whole, whole thing, but come on, power. All right, all right. Increase power, decrease power. Then I have power presets, um, which I need to, uh, need to be toggleable and which I need to be um, changeable. So, power preset toggle put them on that side like that they are now on that uh, that side reset power distribution goes on here like so and power preset increases goes on the other direction Oh heck yes, that is that works nicely, and it uh, kind of corresponds to what I have done with previous games uh, on this sort of stuff. Nice. All right. Um, defensives are entirely uh, done and correct and stuff. Um, Do 
Do I need easy access to these things? No, I actually do not. Radar cycle range actually do. But this thing, um, I'm going to put it right in the numpad. <laughs> because I really don't need, like, that's, that's a, one of those toggle things you either toggle on or off. And don't really need to do that in the thick of combat usually. You can actually think about it a little bit, so... So that, that is kind of nice and nifty. Um, respawn forest, forest respawn for the arena commander. Um, okay. Um, let's do arena commander respawn and forest respawn in uh, another place where I don't usually need to uh, press a key. Um, like this. What is a respawn whilst EVA um, with the uh, right bracket? Alright, so Arena Commander is done. HUD. HUD I still need to play around with. Uh, because these things, uh, I had to rethink the Mobby class can stay here. Shield management. Uh, scoreboard needs to move. And... Right, these things I need to change. Alright. HUD interact mode toggle. Where would I want to put that? Somewhere kind of easily accessible. That, that, could, that could be quite nice indeed. Alright, uh, so... You know what I am doing? First view. Uh, this key needs to now change. It goes to an F5. Because all of this other stuff goes into uh, the F F4, into uh, F3, to F2, and F1. Right. So obviously it shows the default keys for in those windows. And because, I mean, Moby Glass is already bound here. So, yeah. There is that. Where is that? AR mode scoreboard. I honestly do not care about scoreboard, but I might put scoreboard like right here. Something like that. So I can actually view it if I desire. If I so desire. HUD interact mode. But firstly, um. Yeah, firstly, uh. Do this. Uh, forward is here. Uh, backwards is here. Down. Uh, left. Right. HUD confirm. Um, Back and cancel would be then um, here. That makes sense, right? Oh, I can do it on the missile lock side as well. N and M. Hell, let's do it that way around. Makes our life easier. HUD interact mode toggle. Um, it's one of those, one of those weirdo keys, uh, which I do want access to, but I don't need immediate, like, instant access to. So, uh, let's put it on this side, like, for example, right here. Put it on A. Alright, now I still have, um, have some keys. Radar cycle range, then I'm gonna st uh, stick there. Uh, power is all done. Defensive is all done. Missiles is just the launch missile button. I don't know why that can't be under weapons, like frankly. Uh, turrets. Oh right, turrets has its own, own, you know, thing. Gimbal lock. Gimbal lock. 
All right, here I still needed the uh, reticle, focus, gimbal lock, all of that. Um, reticle focus. Oh, right, I needed um, target focus and uh, uh, pin. Uh, so target focus is here. Like that. Um, cycle pinned targets. Pin focus target goes over here. That is kind of easy enough to reach. Cycle pin targets with an alt with the alt keys allows doing them in an easy fashion. And a reticle mode toggle. Another one of those uh, strange keys I might actually need kind of uh, quick access to. So it moves over to comma. Right. Do I, did I have anything in X actually? Did I have anything in X? Very good question. I probably don't. Mouse aim mode. Um... Mouse aim mode, uh, gimbal, lo gimbal lock is one of those keys also which I do not need immediate access to, so it can be an alt key thing. Um, don't believe I have anything in X. Free look can be Z. Um, let's, uh, let's actually change those to... Uh, Left Alt N to look behind. And where was the other one? Um, there is a left. There is a, a, a look forward thing. Was it in, in, in targeting? Oh, come on. Where was look forward? I remember there being look forward and not just look back. No. Is it here? No. Wait, what? How did I lose an entire look uh, thing? Match target velocity. Oh, right, right. That's wh what I needed the X key for. Match target velocity, thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah. Cycle IC, I, IFCS safeties. Um, here we go. Mode shift for that. And ESP toggle. ESP toggle also ki kind of... Um, Kind of interesting. And uh, the mode shift. Alright. Uh, but anyways, anyways, anyways. Um, match target velocity. That's what, what the X key was for. Right? But I was looking for the... Like really? I was looking for the... Uh, uh, look, look uh, like forward key. Dynamic zoom in, look behind. Oh, really? This, uh, uh, this, by the way, is going to be a, um, this kind of thing. Wait, what? Why do you not allow me to? There we go. Um, oh, that is left. What am I doing? Left shift A on... Left shift uh, D... Uh, these sort of keys I don't need immediate access to, but so they can be on there. Um, free look toggle. This thing can still be here in Z. Right? Camera orbit mode. Shift and Z. Uh, 
Come on. Wait, what? I can't bind shift Z. Nope. Apparently I cannot bind shift Z. Well, then it's going to be an alt Z thing. Uh, okay. So apparently this is one of those keys which I cannot find anything, any kind of a combination into. That sucks. That really sucks. Then it's easy. It's a tab. Ugh. One of those keys I... Like, yeah, I don't need the orbit mode thing very time soon. But I am off track. Where is the look forward key? I mean, look left, right. That's all, all here on the mouse. Uh... I distinctly remember there being one. Can't be in targeting. Look ahead! <sighs> it's look ahead, not look forward. Seriously. Seriously! Okay, okay, okay. Now, gimbal lock and all of this stuff uh, is, um, is easy enough. Cycle all targets, um, well, easy and easy, I suppose. Cycle mouse aim mode is going to be here. And uh, gimbal lock. I am going to actually put gimbal lock in a, um, with an alt key thing. I think. Let's do it uh, on that period. Let's do it on that period. That seems reasonable. And critical focus. Do I really need this in a in a easy fashion? Uh, probably not. No. Let's do it there as well. All right. I have targeting down pat. I can't cycle all targets backwards. I could if I did some very strange thing for it that's fine i should have movement keys down oh uh, swap your and roll toggle that i can uh, i will still uh leave it right here wait did i did i leave that thing uh, unbound or uh, did i bind it to where is pin uh focus target It's in O, it shouldn't be right. That's like. It, it sucks, it shows the uh, default key. Um, still. So, uh, swap your roll toggle. It goes here. So, I can actually swap it around if I so desire. So, yeah. Throttle min max toggle would be kind of easy, but I have the double tap for that. Uh, I, I have CS safeties, um, the uh, mode shift I am going to do this with, that is easy and fast to do. Uh, ESP toggle I'm going to put into Q, right, I shouldn't have anything else in Q. Decoupled pitch up and down, uh, mouse movement should take care of that. Uh, landing system. This is still the stuff which uh, and quantum travel, obviously. Uh, and quantum travel, uh, travel. Landing target lock on. All right. You know what? You know what? What this needs to be done on. Of, of course you do. You know exactly where this stuff needs to be on, right? You you are brilliant. This needs to be in the arrow case. That makes it in a in in very very easily accessible location. Um, quantum drive um goes on on the app arrow, right? 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Quantum uh, travel system goes in down arrow and quantum drive itself goes in the up arrow. Do it like that. Right? Seems reasonable. I mean, now it's in, in somewhere I don't accidentally click it or something such. Um, landing target lock on. Let's put that toggle right here. Numpad O. Uh, one of those things I don't need to, you know, essentially rapidly have. Um, auto land mode. I'll leave that in an arrow key as well. Auto land mode. So the landing modes are there next to each other and landing system um what do i want to do with la although actually the whole landing system could be done with a uh, movement keys i could do that very easily like a right alt with a uh, movement key to allow doing that but i might confuse them so i'm going to put landing system here yay yeah Okay, those arrow keys make that life much easier. Um, mode shift and toggle keys. Can I do control with this? Can I? Yeah, I can. Left control Q and left control W. All right, awesome. Awesome. Alright, I think I have keys down pat. Except for the, uh, the, 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 uh, ground keys. Oh, and turret keys. Turret keys, obviously. Um, when I, when in turret mode, do turret mode. Wait, what? Target nearest hostile. Why would it be in R? Acquire missile lock. Oh right. Uh, yeah, 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 because turrets need their own own keys. Of course they do. Um, because I, I'm just copying this this set right from right there, you know, because that makes life much easier. Where, is, where was my gimbal lock? Because I had forgot the right all period. Ah, uh, nope. That's a comma, not a period. Right. Of course, cycle all targets backwards is not bound anywhere. I mean, if I use the same exacts here, uh, life is much easier. Cycle all targets is alt U. I should uh, remember these things. Um, yeah, left alt U. There is still friendly targets for turrets as well, which is awesome. Friendly targets backwards, right alt U. Um, cycle hostile targets. Target nearest hostile uh, is in what? Where? Here? Right? It's in J, right? Nearest hostile. Cycle hostile targets. Alt J and so on. Um. There we go, and uh, this here, pin focus target, wait, did I have that the same key? No, oh, right, 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 I changed it to O, so it's, uh, um, it's closer by, exactly correct, pin focus target, right, now those are the exact same keys. Makes life easier on the turret. Alright. But that also means that targeting is done. Movement is done. Uh, weapons are done. 
missiles well obviously just one key there um launch countermeasures and cycle the ammo oh good lord this key still resets to its default value uh, that sucks so much it sucks so much If I go here, and if I go back to options, that thing has reset to its default value, right? Oh, good lord! Ugh. Come on! Come on! This can't be that difficult. Uh, export control settings. Uh... That sucks so very, very much. Because if I can't still like... Yeah, I, I mean, sure, I could do... um. I, I'll just have to, you know, uh, leave this here. Launch countermeasures. And I have to use weapon. Um, no, wait. I had mouse 4 on the missile, right? So I'll, I'll just... Eventually, once they fix this, I will have the, um... Uh, I will use... Um, I will have to sway or swap those backwards, but, like, seriously. Um, so far, though, it seems like the only key which does that now anymore is the, uh... Is this thing. Let's double-check everything else. Uh, these all stayed, stayed true. That is nice. Those didn't change either, neither did those. Fantastic. Now we just need to own food keys and EVA keys, which is also fantastic. Alright, um, EVA keys, uh, roll left. Uh, roll right. I need to uh, do another um, feedback on that thing. Strafe up and down, strafe up. Strafe down. Thank you. Uh, pitch up. Left alt T. Left alt G. Alt F. Alt H. Right. Um, strafe left. And strafe right. Strafe forward. Backwards. Break. And boost. Why is there no afterburner? Afterburner double tap for EVA. Please. Please do that. That would be brilliant. Alright. On foot case. Um, move left, move right, forward, backwards, jump, uh, crouch, goes here, so does prone, um, sprint goes into a mouse button, that's what how I live. Um, walk goes here. Uh, lean left. I really hate lean keys in games. I'll I'll just be honest and say I really hate that. Weapon stance toggle um goes here. Use item um. Use item. Okay. Where is the... Uh... Oh, come on. Where is the... the, the... Interact use. That key. There we go. There we go. Um, I don't know that... 
place if that thing is correct. Um, zoom out, zoom in, workable, weapon stance, B. Is there a melee button? Yeah, I think there was, right? Mobi glass. Mobi glass can be where uh, it no always is. Spectator camera HUD. Um, put that somewhere like there. Right? Okay. Um, third person free view. Third person view toggle. F5, so it's the same key as for flying. Heal. Um, interact and use. Flashlight toggle. Uh, heal goes here. Actually, no. He heal goes here on this side. Um, yeah. Reload. Now, uh, I'm going to put holster weapon on that, actually, and use heal instead, use heal here. Now, uh, why key? Press button key! Um, flashlight... Flashlight toggle over here. Actually, do I need it that close? Change weapon fire mode, um... Now, if I do heal and I put use item here instead. No, no, no. What am I doing? Use item is obviously in I and heal is in U and uh, uh, all that stuff. And holster weapon is in E. No, wait. What? Holster weapon is in S. What the heck? I've been looking at these keys entirely wrong again. There. Uh, heal in you uh, okay those are correct at least those can stay uh, spectator camera lock ah that can stay as it is I mean if I am spectating I don't need to lean right so these things are correct. That is correct. Flashlight toggle goes to somewhere like, uh, um, I don't know. No, actually, M is going to be the grenade key. That means I should probably use put a uh, use item there instead. Yeah, let's do that. Use item is going to be in M, so it's going to be the grenade, the grenade key. Weapon stance is, can be in B. Weapon stance in J. There does not seem to be a melee key, unless I am seeing something really wrong. Does not seem to be so. So. That means uh, uh, J works, and then I can do a uh, flashlight toggle in 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 here. Happen change fire mode. Actually, um, L. Whole breath is left alt. Okay, let's go through this now. So I can know uh, I did correct movements, crouch prone, walk, lean, mouse for for sprint, use item. Oh right, weapon selection key still on. Select sidearm, select, select sidearm, select primary weapon, select secondary weapon. And select item. Correct. Next item. And previous item. Makes life easier. Reload. Holster weapon. Hold breath. Change fire mode. Interact. 
flashlight heal. Actually, I can just uh, um, change weapon fire mode can be just here, right? And then then put the AR key somewhere then as well. All right. Eh. Here. All right. EVA keys should be correct. Uh, vehicle keys I still need to change. This is taking a while. Um, then I'm going to... Uh, this point I'm going to hop in here again. Engines low. Danger. System overheating. Engines low. Wait, what? What is happening here? Some gear got busted, huh? No, 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 no. Uh, power. Some key doesn't work for some reason. Or did I, uh, did I press something else here? Okay, flying seems to work. As does... Okay, double tapping... Engine. Double ta tapping throttle doesn't seem to work. Interesting. Very interesting. Um... Right, um, that sucks. Warning, you are approaching simulation boundary. Well, that that is interesting. It's like I can rebind the keys, but they don't seem to do anything. Stand by for reintegration. Okay, uh, X to respawn does nothing. Oh, right, it's the um. What, what did it did it then uh, do that key correctly? Actually, did it actually do that key correctly? Because that would be brilliant if it did. Oh yeah, uh, so it fixed that key. System over. Aegis combat assist activated. Systems green. All right, cool. No, no flying works. So, um, okay. So no keys work, right? I don't know what that was all about. Something, something screwed up. All right. I can still do turn cobbled mode on. Oh hell yeah! All right. Alright, uh, that is broken. That is really broken. Alright. At least I can fly with these keys then. Awesome, fantastic. Um, So I can have these key flight keys. Uh, does the double tap work? Oh hell yeah it does. Okay, something, something broke then uh, last time. For some odd reason. All right, cool. Um, now let's check uh, those keys out and see which ones of them reset. Uh, because I know for a fact there there was like four or five keys which reset, aside of the missile one. The missile one still seems to reset. Uh, need to uh, report that with uh, some feedback. Uh, this stuff seems correct. I'm just essentially skimming through it. Okay, so it seems correct. Uh, the most interesting test is to go back to hangar and see how many keys reset when I do that. Uh, targeting is correct. 
You oh yes, nearest hostile. Those things are correct. Um, missiles, defensive, power stayed the same. Fantastic radar haven't changed. Um, HUD. All right. Um, all right then. Let's see. What happens if I, uh, okay, the HUD keys work. That works. Mobby class works. Oh, nice. Very nice. So, uh, it seems just the missile key is breaking up on me. EVA keys, just double check. Alright, seems correct. On food keys. Oh, come on. There was a number of on food keys, like, like I mean, uh, back in the day I couldn't rebind the uh, um, sprint and stuff. A sprint and crouch both were unbindable last time I was playing around with this, so I couldn't obviously do that. Ground vehicle keys. Alright, let's uh, do ground vehicle keys. Um, exit seat. Do I do I just use the exact same keys as I use here? I mean, of course I do. Of course I do. Exit it. I see it. I was just double checking that it was on this side. Um, no, uh, exit seat is here, right? Wait, 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 wait. Exit seat is, is that thing. Yep. Why does it say self-destruct then? I have no idea. Uh, lights toggle. Actually, lights toggle might be more useful for ground vehicles anyway. So, and ground vehicles do not roll in general, so I'm going to put them there. Uh, cycle camera view. Same key. Um, look left, right. Cycle all targets. Uh, yeah, cycle targets. Right there. Ground vehicle movement. Wait, ground vehicles are roll. Do have roll. So, uh, in that case, light toggle can be somewhere right here. Unless there is decoupled mode for these things as well. Nope, there isn't. Fantastic. Okay. Yo, as in turn left, I mean, it's not really yo if you are on the uh, ground. Roll. I wanna, I wanna be able to roll with a, uh, with, with like, roll keys with something like a tank. I mean, that would be like brilliant, obviously. Just, you know, hoover tank and whatnot, let me roll, make, make barrel rolls with it. Or just spin it around. Ground vehicle gunner, um, yeah. Okay, um... Now, the big, big test. Go into hangar. I realize this video has taken about an hour by now. But hey, uh, you decided to sit around and watch me do this after all, so... If this works, if in hangar uh, the keys hasn't, haven't reset yet, then I will be quite happy. Then of course there is something like a, a zone into a port Olizar and everything resets. So that would be fucking painful. Alright, keys. Keys, keys, keys. Ugh. Go through the stuff. Did not reset. View. Did not reset. All right, good. Uh, movement. Did not reset. Oh, heck yes. Heck yes. Movement did not reset. Fantastic. Targeting. Mouse aim. 
alt keys all that oh heck yes turrets nice missiles still have to stay that way because this thing resets all right All right then. Um. Wow, that stuff isn't reset either. I am impressed. Suddenly, I am quite impressed. All right. Oh, right. Um, export this control profile now properly, or rather, um, import it. Yeah. Um. export fantastic and now um here we go yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna stop this whole thing here i have done the keys uh, i have uh tested the out now quite bad actually there is one more test to be done let's go uh, do that and then i will um And then I will uh, conclude the video. One more test. If uh, loading into here does not reset keys, then life is so much better and I can actually fl start fly really flying in this game. Because, oh my gosh, if, you know, freaking rebinding key thing is painful. Painful, painful, painful. All right, painful. Trust me, it is. Uh, anyway, it's take a while to uh, uh, rebind keys. Obviously, always does. All, all is well. I'm okay with that. Um, majority of those keys, uh, um, like, I don't need fast access to anyway. So they went into strange places where I have to probably look it up a, 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 cup, a time or two. It's like, okay, where did I actually put that thing in? But most of the keys I remember by heart because they are in locations which are of like I have used uh, previously uh, for same key essentially same or similar key. Um, is that still here? Yeah, that is still hardbound. That thing needs to um, also be talked about. Um, Oh heck yes. Walking keys have not reset. Um, yeah, I'm only really interested in just, you know, double checking. Ah, I don't, I won't make you watch me double check. I will do the full double check here as well now. Anyway, um, thank you very, very much for watching. If you actually made it this far, you are a, well, more power to you, okay? You you watched me play around with keybinds for over an hour. Anyway, thank you very very much for watching. Oh, um, uh, yeah, let's get to that keybinding. <laughs>